If you've got a container that you perhaps want to perform an experimental update on, or you want to do a configuration change, you could clone it first. And to do that, we'll pick on the paperless demo container I've got here. You'd say PCT clone 1002, and we'll call it 400. And in just a moment, it will go through the process to make an exact clone of that machine under a different VM ID, and we'll be able to run that just like we would the one we started with. All right, the process has finished. If we clear our screen and we do PCT list again, we'll see that we do have VM ID 400. We can start that. And then we can go into the container and it's been up for zero minutes. It's freshly installed. And as we can see from the screen, the original 1002 is not in fact running.